Carla's not my therapist anymore. Wait, so Chris didn't give her the sack, but you did? No one got sacked. I graduated because I'm better, thanks to Carla. Now we're just friends. Here we go. Oh, we didn't order anything. Well, my case and my I treat. <laughs> thanks, Bob. Yeah, you really don't have to do oh, this. Oh, just eat. It's such a joy to have you here. You know, hanging out and all happy and relaxed. Like the good old days. <laughs> so what were you talking about? Oh, sorry. Am I being nosy? I just don't want to argue, Mum. Well, why would you assume I'd argue? We were talking about Carla, and we know you don't like, so let's just change the subject. Oh, it's really the devil. But it's an expression. And don't worry, everyone loves Carla now, including Chris. So, I've given up. I'm jumping on the Carla train. Say it like you mean it, Mum. Don't want anything for peace, but don't mind Nicole back. <laughs> So, look at you two, catching up on old times, are we? Actually, we've been talking about Zara and Boyd. And Rami, and how we all might come together and help her. Yeah, this, not just Rami. Apparently, we're still waiting on Boyd. Well, I'm sure he'll be here soon. Uh, we're gonna head home now. Our place for dinner, if you like. Oh, really? Of course. Thank you very much. From we'll see you there. I might ask Boyd and, and Rani too, what do you think? Oh, lovely idea. Actually, after such a public showdown, they might need a little bit of space. Yeah, like you so often are. <laughs> Best not to intrude where we don't belong. Thanks for dinner, Ned. It was yum. You're welcome. Delicious. <laughs> and the burnt bits weren't a problem at all. Alright, we're gonna pop next door. Get you later, buddy. Probably be in bed by the time I get back. Yes, he will. After he cleans his teeth. See ya. See ya. Bye. Upstairs, hum. Brush, brush, brush. Brush, brush. Carla, she doesn't leave you alone. Friends find each other. I'll take this outside. Sure. Hi, what's that? She called every night, does she? Or just when she knows I'm here? They are mates, Leanne. It's got nothing to do with you. You didn't see the look that Carla gave me at the hooey. Just let it go in there. And as for that hooey, appalling. She calls herself a therapist. I still can't fathom why Chris has kept her on. Coffee? It's like she's got a hold over him. Or a tea. Something in her past. And Chris knows something, and so does Nicole. And they won't blimmin' well tell me. Is that a no to the tea? I don't suppose Nicole's told you anything, little pillow talk, hmm? About Carla's past? Absolutely. 100%. No way am I telling you. Oh, shame on you for asking. Oh, you're worse than your mother. Oh, she is. I wonder what they're talking about now. We managed to get through dinner with no screaming or fighting matches. Was that for progress? Actually, that's sort of why I followed. Are you not just bored of working late and missing me? I couldn't help myself. I'm a terrible person. Why? What did you do? I made a mean, nasty, scary face at Leanne. And she saw. Why would you do that? She was doing my head in. She was undermining the hooey. Not that that's an excuse.